And Christine, that manhunt is growing this late hour, stretching out. Let's get you right into the story, searching for the gunman who shot that L.A. County Sheriff's deputy. The cross here is Alameda, just a couple blocks off the 105 freeway, mostly an industrial area. Down that street, past all the flashing lights, Fernwood out. That's where, really, it's a running gunfight between sheriff deputies and the suspect. Their vehicles riddled with bullet holes. One of the deputies hit, rushed off to the ER. Let's take some more video coming in. You can imagine when all this was happening, Officer Down, you had a response as the video shows coming from law enforcement all over the place. Deputies rushing here. You had LAPD rushing with some black and whites. City of Gardena, Culver City, all sending black and whites to try to help out. The deputies heard uh, saying there's, that we're taking rounds, and this gunfight apparently went on for a couple of minutes. Some video also showed the black and white from the sheriff's department riddled with bullet holes. The, presumably the suspect's pickup truck also riddled with bullet holes. One of the deputies hit by gunfire. Another deputy doesn't wait for paramedics or the ambulance to arrive. He puts the injured deputy in his black and white, rushes him to nearby St. Francis Medical Center. We're told that deputy being treated now, but not life-threatening injuries. Meantime, the suspect's able to get away from the shooting scene. He's around now in a perimeter where investigators think they have him tied up. Some more video. This is aerial video from Sky Fox. Gives you an idea of a wide perimeter here. We've been hearing the, uh, the airship from the Sheriff's Department making announcements in English and Spanish, presumably to the suspect below, saying, we've got you surrounded, give up, surrender, we're about to send the canine team in. No response, though, from the suspect, for what we're also hearing is they think they have an idea in this industrial area where he's holed up. They're moving in SWAT resources now and some canines to eventually make an arrest, bring that suspect into custody. But all of this coming in is a robbery call in this industrial area, and as those responding first deputies arrived, they were hit with gunfire, and it was just basically a shootout for a couple of minutes until it all ended with one of the deputies being rushed to the ER. Back out here live. So the manhunt goes on for the suspect himself. They feel they have him surrounded in this growing perimeter. Now it's just a matter of time until they can make an arrest. What we're hearing from the St. Francis Medical Center is good news. The deputy, we're told, not suffering life-threatening injuries. He was awake. He was alert as he was rushed to the ER by one of his partners. And at this point, everybody's just breathing a sigh of relief. And as the deputies here say, we're not going to give up. We're not going to clear the scene until we make an arrest and get that that gunman in custody. For now, we're live here in Linwood. Back to both of you.